In this video, I'm going to show you how you can cast a VLC media player over to your Google Chromecast device. So before you begin, make sure your Chromecast is set up and is connected to your Wi-Fi and so on. Also make sure you have the latest version of VLC media player as older versions will not support this. So to cast your Chromecast device, open up the media player. Now bear in mind, this works kind of on and off for me personally. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, so just bear in mind you may have to be patient and just try it multiple times until it actually works. Perhaps it's my PC setup, but in my experience it is a bit temperamental. So from the list in the top left hand corner, all you need to do is select playback. And then from playback, select renderer. Put your mouse pointer over it. Now you may need to wait 10, 20, 30 seconds until it scans and picks up your Chromecast device. Sometimes it may not pick it up, sometimes it does. As I just said, it can be temperamental. But when it does pick up your Chromecast device, select your Chromecast device, mine is called Bedroom TV. So nothing will happen now at all. So what you need to do is um, click on Media, then select Open File, and then choose a video from your PC. For example, I'll just choose a video here. So click on a video, and hopefully within a few seconds, you should see that video now starts loading on your screen. I know you can't see anything. But that video I just picked there, Nightmare on Elm Street, is now playing on my TV screen. And again, just to go back and forward, just use the timeline down here. And it should fast forward to the selected um, section on the video and so on. And of course, you can use the, the pause button down here to pause the video and to play it again. And everything will kind of appear on your, t on your TV screen and work as normal. So basically, this is really simple as that, to select the playback option, renderer, and select your Chromecast device and choose your video and it should start playing. So that's how you do it. Thanks for watching.